Hi, it is Casey Mash, and welcome to a video. And today, it is December 23rd, so it is my birthday. And today, we are going to a Dave & Buster's to kind of like celebrate. So, we already had dinner, and we're now headed to Dave & Buster's. I have my map out, uh, iPad. And yeah, I'm just gonna be doing a challenge saying how much well, not really a challenge, but I'm going to say, how much tickets can I get off of one game? So, I'm going to do one game for all of my money. I'll tell you guys how much money I'll have in a second. But that's basically our challenge. And I'll, sh I'll film my brother. Um, but yeah, I'll just film my brother playing other games. But the main challenge, or not challenge, the main thing is me doing the one game with all my money. And we're just going to see how much tickets more you can earn by just doing multiple games. So see you guys when we're arriving. I'm just about to find out how much money I'm gonna get on my card, so. This place is like ginormous. I like the logo. It's awesome. This place is huge. I've like never been in a Dave & Buster's in like years. So the game I was thinking of doing is spin and win. I'm gonna get like 80 tickets every single round. I have 170 chips, which equals to $30. So, spin and win is the game I'm gonna be doing like 22 times, and we looked it up, and if I get 80 tickets every single time, which is gonna be pretty easy, because of how big the slot is, I'll end up with around 1,700 tickets. So, let's just begin. We might do a time lapse or just add it to the end, so.
So I got 80 almost every time, but I got 60 like a couple times, and I got 40 once, but it's not bad. So end up at least over a thousand tickets. So Teague ended up not wanting to be filmed because I don't know why he just didn't want to be filmed. We're actually leaving right now, but I he ended up with I think 920 tickets, and he bought soda, uh, fizzy flavored candy, and I ended up with. 1,320 tickets and I thought I was going to get like 1,700 but it's only because I missed the 80 a couple times but I got a uh, soda flavored fizzy candy I got a like spring thing that you pop up and like play with it's pretty cool uh, Bat19 sells it it's basically called, it's the same thing but um, it's called the Toro Flux go check out Bat19 they have awesome products and that was worth like 250. The fizzy candy was worth 250. And then what else did I get? <laughs> I got the. Uh, um. Did I get anything else? Hold on a second. Oh yeah, I got the fizzy. Yeah, I got the uh, spray. I got spray candy, blue raspberry spray candy. So right now I'm just gonna show you a closer look of what things I got. First, I got a fire extinguisher bottle, looking. Blue raspberry flavored sour spray candy. And then you just press this pump right here to like, like make it go, shoot. It's not sour though. And I also, these were the fizzies. So it came with two of these. It says Sprint. This is lemon lime, which is basically a uh, Sprite. I don't like these, so I gave them to my brother. Came with two of these. Um, this one is Crash, and basically it's just Orange Crush. Here we have this one, uh, Coca-Cola. That's just, yeah, basically. Coca-Cola Fizz Candy, and last but not least, uh, Splash, which is basically, uh, Fanta Grape version. And he gave me two of those. And... Last but not least, I have uh, the Toro Flux thing. This was 250 tickets. This was not bad at all. Vat19 sells it for $25, I think. Plus $5 shipping. And basically, I saw these and I've heard that Vat19 just takes products and sells them. It might just be a rumor. I don't know if that's true. But... I watched this YouTube video saying $5, to $5 spring toy versus Toro Flux. And actually it was a tie because literally they are like literally the same thing. Basically what both of them do is like it's just, it looks like a normal spring. You tap it like this, it opens up into like that. You push your down, you push your hand down and turn it and it folds down like that. And you can like hold part of it and like let my hand below go and then it will like open up like that it's really cool and also what it's meant for is that if you like put your hand down the middle and then like you have to even your hand out at the top with the springs which takes a couple minutes or a couple seconds i mean you can actually like roll roll it on your hand like this Woo. it's actually really smooth it kind of tickles it feels good on your arms too. It's actually really fun. You can like roll it down any like pole. You can roll down a pole or anything and then it's just so cool and satisfying looking. It almost feels satisfying if that's a thing. So that is basically a closer look at all of my items. If you guys want, go to bad19.com or just look up these things. They're so fun to play with. So, that was really fun. If you guys liked the video, please like and subscribe. And I will see you guys all later. Bye! So, I actually, um, I'm just going to show you guys a closer look of what things I got. So, the first thing is that I got fire extinguisher bottle looking blue raspberry sour spray candy. Basically, you just press this pump and it comes out. 
No! What is it?